different van right now. I had to bring a buddy to town. He had an outpatient surgery, so I drove his van. But while I was waiting for him to get done, I went over to a uh, local building supply to find a flange from my window, and they wanted $44 for it, or $43.99. So I said, never mind, but I did see a really cool ice chest in there for a good price. Um, it was like 89 bucks, and it was kind of a copy of a Pelican or a uh, Yeti, but it looks like it would be nice, kind of worth the money. Um, but anyway, so I'm in line to pick him up on the outpatient side of the building, so he'll be getting here soon, and then when I get back to where my van is at, I'll finish working on this video. I'll talk to you guys in a bit. Bye. Okay, what came in the mail today was my vents I ordered. I'm going to make a vent for the window up front in the driver's area. Here, let me set them in the window and show you. See how they'll sit in there and I'll make a frame for them and I can just shut the window around them. I think that'll work. I don't know, I thought it was a good idea so we're gonna give it a shot. Okay, let me show you. I spilled myself a little bit here. I bought me a mouse pad and I bought three pairs of sunglasses. They're like 11 bucks for three pair. My birthday's in July. And so this is my birthday present to me. I think, I think I like it. And I needed the mouse pad for my mouse for my MacBook. But then I seen these glasses on Amazon, three pair for $11.97. I like the little cheap sunglasses, um, but I got me three of them three pair of them and I really like the white ones but I like the silver ones and the black ones so I like all three anyway and if anybody that knows me I love sunglasses hats and shoes those are my three favorite things and a lot of time I just wear sunglasses as a hood ornament on top of my head but uh, anyway thought I'd show you guys what I got and what else I got in the mail um, so I'm excited about that and I'll get off here guys and we'll have a little chat uh, before the end of the video. What's up, guys? I made it back home. Uh, anyway, uh, what a what a strange day. I man, there's a big old fly in here. I'm gonna smack him if he comes by here. So be careful. I'll crack this window so you'll go out maybe. Um, <clears throat> so anyway, I got the kitties outside except one, Jacob. He's inside with me. He didn't want to go outside, and I've got the air conditioner on right now, so it's kind of cool in here. It's a little warm, but they're chilling like villains. I'm looking at them right here. They're chilling out there, relaxing. Um, anyway, so uh, I got my buddy home uh, that I'd taken. He lives in the cabin on the property here, and, and uh, he, he's uh, feeling better. Uh, he was out for a couple of hours, but yeah, he was pretty woozy driving him home. But anyway, while I was in town, I was telling you guys, I went to the... I'll tell you the story a little better now. I went to the building supply store here. I'm not going to say the name. It wasn't a, a Home Depot. It was a smaller one, but they're kind of big. And uh, so I went in and so I'm walking by, I'm walking around looking for flange in roofing area, like a, a flash, you know, flashing. And I couldn't find anything. I go over by the stove area and, and cause Johnny's Journey uh, sent me a thing of like what goes on a roof, uh, a cover of like a, a vent on a roof. Um, and it was only like 28 bucks. And so, <clears throat> So I, I'm looking there and I don't see nothing. And then I, I look in dryer vent area and I find a cool vent that would work. And it was, it already had a flange on it. Like, I don't know what it went to. I think it actually went to maybe like some type of, you put it on a roof over a pellet stove maybe. Um, so anyway, I, I pick it up. I don't see any more like it. And I, and I go up to the guy working in that area and I go, how much is this? And he goes, well, I don't know. There's no price. I go, I know. <laughs> That's why I'm asking you. There's no price on it. And he goes, huh? So he couldn't figure it out. So we walk across the store to somebody that apparently has worked there longer. And he goes, um, and so they walk to the front of the store at the cash register and ask the lady up there. And she goes, um, I said, you know what? Never mind. Uh, just where is some where is some aluminum flange or flash or I just need a piece of about a foot square and so I they they said um I said never mind so I go look and I find a piece of flange or flash whatever you want to call it but it already had a hole in it that would fit perfect to a dryer vent and so I pick up the dryer vent and under this 
uh, flan the piece of flange or flash, whatever you want to call it, was it said ten ninety nine, and there was a whole st a whole stack of them, and so I said, okay, I'll take that. And so it would have been like sixteen bucks for it in the vent. I get in line, wait twenty minutes probably in that line, and I get up there, and she she says um forty eight ninety nine. I go what? And she goes, well, I go, how much is that piece of aluminum? <laughs> and she says, forty three ninety nine. I'm like, what? I said, is it gold filled? And she said, um, I said, you know what? Never mind. I don't want it. So I went home. I, I went out to the van and I, I, that's where I went over to a park to wait for him to get out of his uh, surgery. And uh, I did some B-roll over there of the park in the area around where I was at. So, but on the way there, I was so pissed. Uh, I stopped at, I was hungry. I stopped at uh, Wendy's and it was breakfast time and, and I hadn't ate. And uh, I thought, well, you know, I'll eat something from Wendy's and I won't eat lunch. That way I don't get too much sodium in me today. And I won't eat any fries or, you know, hash browns or anything. And so I got a, this was so good too. And it sounded so good. It's called a maple bacon chicken croissant. Holy snacks, man. That was good. I One of the best sandwiches I ever ate. So I gave up lunch for that today. I had that for breakfast and a glass of water and a cup of coffee. So I, I didn't eat lunch today. And now I'm starting to get hungry. It's getting late. I'm going to try to eat dinner about 7 and stay with really light. Uh, anything that Nothing with sodium because I know fast food is loaded in sodium. Uh, so anyway... Um, and so yeah it's been kind of working on today i've worked on home improvements as you can see what i got in the mail i think that's going to work out great once i build a frame around that i would use flange or flash but apparently those are really expensive so what i may do is get it on that i may get a, a thin piece of i don't know some type of board or maybe a piece of ply or like paneling i have some extra pieces of paneling because and then i'll just paint it uh, like black or maybe um, just a darker color and uh, stick it in the window and that way the kitties can't get out and the window can be open you know a good six seven inches and get good ventilation in here um, so I may do that I don't know unless I, I I'm gonna go to Home Depot and see if I can find cheaper flash or planned or whatever you want to call it, like I said uh, it, it, I, I can't believe that was forty three ninety nine. I was in shock I'm thinking, dude, did they fill it with gold or what? Uh, anyway, got my new pair of sunglasses. Yes, I opened them before my birthday because I got them in the mail and I knew what they was. Um, but anyways, uh, I, I really like these glasses. Um, I usually wear them on my head, but see, these kind of look funky because they're white. But they look good on my head. And I usually wear my glasses as head ornaments anyway, unless I'm in the sun. So... You know, I like glasses. I like glasses, and I like hats, and I like shoes. Those are the three things I used to buy a lot of until I got old enough to be smart enough to save my money. Um, <laughs> but, all right, guys, I guess there's not much else going on today. And I'm not using the mic today because I used it in part of the... No, I actually erased it and voiced over it without the mic. The, not the mic that I used with my MacBook on my live, but the mic that I got for this time, I'm kind of not happy with it. it it's too teeny. Too much twinge like or trouble in it um i just don't like it so i'm talking just with the, the ipad anyway guys all right i want you guys to take care of yourselves take care of each other i want you to have a great day and i'll see you tomorrow talk to you later Bye.